Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. I was just tagged by the lovely Miss Your Average Girl. Um, it's a fall tag. That's what it's called. I don't even know. Yeah, have it's the... a fall tag. Okay. So I'm gonna have my daughter ask me the questions. I'm gonna answer and she's gonna give her answer as well. So you get a double, like two <laughs> for one special here. We figure we're gonna take a rest and we're gonna do this tag and get it out of the way since we're out in fall with <laughs> autumn doing a fall tag. <laughs> All right. So the first question is, what is your favorite fall scent? My favorite fall scent probably would be like apple cinnamon, I guess. I'm not much of a pumpkin spice. Sorry, all of you pumpkin lovers either. out there. That's just not my thing. I like apple cinnamon, I guess. That and I'm like the mine. queen of fall and I hate yes. pumpkin spice. Her name is literally Autumn. <laughs> So, okay. um, my favorite fall scent is probably like any fall scented candle because like fall is like usually like the cozy time mm -hmm. where you like you like your candles. Do you like, like the scent of leaves or anything too or? Mm. I think that's more masculine yeah. to me. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. That's again, not my thing. I just. Or like having like a hot drink, like hot chocolate and like the smell oh, of it. Oh, yes. So nice. But that reminds me more of winter than it does fall. Okay. Second question is, best way to spend a rainy day? Mine would be in bed with my blinds up so I can like hear and see the rain like on mm -hmm. the window and watching Netflix in bed like all cozy mm. with like my jeans, well not jeans, like sweatpants and like my blankets. Mine would probably be one of my lovely three hour baths. Just, you know, I used to do those yeah, all maybe the time. with some apple cinnamon scented candles <laughs> while watching Netflix yeah. in the bathtub. <laughs> oh, yeah, I could do that now. Yeah. I have Netflix on my phone. Exactly. Third question is What is your favorite fall drink? Well, you just said hot chocolate. Well, I like whatever. French vanilla, like from Tim Hortons. Hmm. Tim Hortons is like a Canadian thing yeah. you guys should know. Well, apparently they have it in Minnesota too, Mitchell well, says. So, hmm. yeah. Cool. <laughs> Um, mine, I don't, I don't really drink anything but water yeah. now. I never but see you drink anything. It's not my favorite thing, like if I could actually mm -hmm. drink something. You occasionally have tea. I see you yeah. have tea maybe like once every like yeah. few months. <laughs> I know. Well, smooth move tea. It's kind of a necessity. <laughs> well, yeah, that too. After surgery. But, um, my favorite fall drink. See, I've never been into those pumpkin spice lattes or anything like that. It's just not my thing. I just thing. like plain, like, hot chocolate. I guess I would choose hot chocolate, too. Would be a favorite, but that would be prior to surgery because mm -hmm. I could not drink it now at all, and nor would I because it would make me really sick. Not worth it. So, this question's kind of dumb, but football or nah? Nah! <laughs> <laughs> no, I used to watch football because my ex, but, like... Other than that, I haven't watched it since. I don't care for it at all. No. Um, favorite fall clothes. I like what you're wearing now. This is my Probably favorite this. outfit on you. This was hers. Yeah. Well, it was hers. To be, it's supposed to be like an oversized like. Yeah, hoodie and it's and, like, really big now. It's really when long. I got it, it was like it fit me perfectly. But it's so now. Cute on her though. Yeah. But again, not in this weather. Mosquito still out. Yeah, we have Bentley tied up here because he's on the walk with us and yeah he's whimpered a little bit <laughs> so what about you um i really like cardigans like woolly thick cardigans mm -hmm. with like a leggings of course and like some booties with like maybe a heel boot favorite know. piece of clothing not wardrobe oh. <laughs> <laughs> sorry <laughs> um so you choose between the three haunted house haunted hayride or a corn maze Haunted house. I'd get lost. That was easy for you. I'd get lost in a maze. Corn mazes are pretty scary. Yeah. Just even if they're not haunted. I went to this one corn maze that had people who were dressed up as like scary characters, and they all like. And it's at nighttime. Keep in mind. That would be. Fun. It's not lit up either. That would be fun. Like the only light you get is from the moon. And your cell phone. Well that's now. It. Well yeah. <laughs> Back then I didn't. I don't even think I had. Yeah. One. But I went. I've also. I've done all three of those things. But my favorite was not probably me. the hayride because like one I'm lazy. <laughs> <laughs> and I don't know, but I don't know. It's just fun to be. Hayrides like, are fun, oh, but 
they wouldn't be haunted. Like, what is people it? They jump, take you people through? People jump, like, on the back of them and scare the crap out of people who are, like, in the back or, like, on the oh, sides I of I don't it. know. I've never experienced that in my life, so. Yeah. But I'd just choose a haunted house. I feel like mine would probably be a corn maze still. But it's really fun. Um, scariest movie you've ever seen? Hmm. I'm Again, scared of literally everything. I don't want Nothing scares movies. me, but... I guess the only, like, most recent one would probably have been The Conjuring. Like, Paranormal Activity was pretty scary, too, when it first came out. The only thing, I reason I find these scary is because I've had experience with Paranormal. Like, the type of things that happened in those movies have happened to me. That may be a good story time one day. But, yeah, these kind of things happened to me when I was a kid. That's why now I'm, you know, that's the only thing that scares yeah. me. Like... Jason and Friday the 13th, like those kind of movies they're don't like, scare they're me. They're funny. comical yeah. horror movies, you know. You know what to expect in them, but yeah, I guess it would be like Conjuring and Paranormal Activity, those type of movies. Right now, if I watched them, I probably wouldn't find them scary, mm -hmm. but when they first came out, I did find them scary. So, I don't really watch scary movies. I try to avoid them <laughs> at all costs. Um, the Lion King. No. Be scary for her. But... Probably the only one that scared me the most was Paranormal Activity. That yeah. one, like, ruined me. That's why I don't watch <laughs> scary movies. Aww. And, like, everybody else, like, because that one time we watched it, I was so scared. I literally had, like, nightmares. I'd always, like, when Aww. I'd open my door, I'd look across the hallway and see, like, my brother's room. And I'd always, like, my mind would, like, play tricks on me. And I'd see, like, figures, like, outside Aww. of his door. And I would just, like, it ruined me. And, like, I still feel that way at work. Like, I feel like my work is literally haunted when I'm cleaning by myself. <laughs> <laughs> but like I don't know I think that's probably the scariest one I've seen other than that I haven't really seen much other ones because of that oh, it like wow. ruined it for me <laughs> um what's your favorite candy for Halloween well now nothing or chocolate. I can't have candy prior to surgery there's chips there's drinks and everything that it comes with yeah too. but it's not candy well they mean probably like Just what you Halloween get for, treat yeah you're gonna drop that yet it's already <laughs> fell off I know, almost um I'd probably say like peanut like m&m peanuts those are really I, good yeah i think that's probably was my favorite i also like the crispy crunch actually those two i always used to be gave my her favorite. all my yeah. crispy crunches because i don't like them i loved them chocolate in general like except for mars bars i find Ew. them too sweet and plus yeah we get them all the time at home and they just you know i just could never Mm -hmm. I couldn't eat them now, but I mean, I'm talking prior to surgery. There's just, I just never like them. They're too sweet for me. Mm, me? If it counts, obviously chips. Um, or chocolate-wise? What kind Probably of Twix. chips? I love Twix. Even if they're just plain potato chips. Just plain, yeah. I like literally any chip. Like, give me any chip. I think I'll that's the it. most popular one you get at Halloween, too. Yeah. It's just plain. They're or the Doritos. Cheapest. They're the cheapest to buy. Like yeah. you, get those, so. you usually get the no-name brand ones. I don't mind that. I love them. Uh, but, oh well. yeah. For chocolate, it's definitely Twix. I love Twix. Mm. Candy, I don't like candy at all. We never get Score. I love Score. I love Score, too. But... I don't yeah. think they come in like mini. No, I've never seen them. Me neither. I like liked Smarties too. I don't like those. Those are like kind of like M and M's. You Americans might not know what Smarties are because your Smarties are those tiny little chalky round candies. Well, here in Canada, they're tiny little like candy coated chocolate, like M and M's. They're not as good as M and M's. No, M and M's are way better. Yeah, they're sweeter. They're like smaller, but yeah, Smarties are like a knockoff. Um, what will you or your kids be for Halloween? <laughs> I'm going as a girl from the movie The Purge, and I'm going to have, like, a white, long t-shirt that's, like, almost, like, dress length, and I'm going to have, like, fake blood all over it, I'm going to have the scary mask that they use for The Purge, because you guys see in the movie, they usually, like, everybody wears masks, so, like, you mm -hmm. don't tell like, what their, like, identity is, because, like, obviously they kill people and whatnot. I was not planning on doing anything i've i'm trying to get her to come out for halloween with us so because i'm also going with my friend mm -hmm. who lives with us well i'd just be walking but i wouldn't well, yeah. be like trick-or-treating or anything i just feel like i'm gonna slow you guys down no. that's why i don't want to it'll be you fun know. You i haven't even, been out film. for halloween since they were little since the boys were little like, well now is your time my to mom relive. was taking them now because is your time i wouldn't to go live. anymore i know but 
Maybe I'll get, I don't know. You could even get like a cheap costume from the dollar store. Just get like a headband and like a shirt. It something. would have to be just a mask. I'm not going to fit a well. costume. He's not happy right now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he looks so funny. <laughs> he looks like he's wearing an eye patch. We have him tied to the post. Okay. Um, favorite fall recipe? Me. It's not really a recipe, but I really like those Pillsbury cookies that have like the little pumpkin things on them. They're so cute and they taste so good. They're like sugar cookies, but they're like fall, fall recipe. I don't think this would be considered a fall recipe, honestly, but I would say like banana bread. Mm. I don't know. Would you consider that fall? I feel like if you add cinnamon to it, it'd be like a fall. Thing. I usually do anyways when yeah. I used to make it. But, yeah. Last or time like I made it, I made it with um, Splenda, like the artificial sweetener. It did not turn out like <laughs> the real thing. I usually like to make it with brown sugar, but if I did that, I couldn't eat it well, at all. What does Thanksgiving count? So. Because it's in fall. Thanksgiving. Like dinner? Yeah, like Thanksgiving. Like turkey and oh. gravy and all that. Yeah, that counts. Hell yeah! Because <laughs> I love that too. Yeah. Um, favorite thing about fall? <laughs> I just... My daughter was born! <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, like three days before fall. I know, but still. Um, um, I like the cold weather. Like yeah. I know it's very cliche, but I love the cold because I'm just so sick of the heat. It's beautiful. The leaves changing color mm -hmm. and falling and just... I do love the cooler weather though. Yeah, it's like so where nice. you could just go out like this and not bundle up. Well, not this because you know? yeah. I got too warm so I took off my... Yeah. Um, and like dressing up, like layers and stuff, I love layering clothes. Like, I love that. So. I've never done that. I love it. Like, wearing, like... I couldn't fit anything. Hoodies. I'd be happy to be able to fit anything. <laughs> like, thick, woolly, long sleeve mm -hmm. shirts with, like, a blazer jacket and, like, some booties, some knee-high boots even. We get it. You love clothes. I love clothes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and... What question are the, we at? We're at 11. So, the last question is, who else do you tag? There's 12 questions. Yes. Favorite thing oh. was the last one, so there's that. Okay. Who am I going to tag? I'm going to tag Mitchell in Minnesota because I know he loves the fall. I like your bird. <laughs> I really like That's his bird. Daniel. Oh, wrong person. Wrong person. Cut that out. <laughs> um, and I'm going to tag little Kansas Kitty. I'm going to tag... Hmm, again, I never thought about this beforehand. <laughs> but I know those two like the fall. Daniel's journey. He changed his name. Thank you, Daniel. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> Easier. Yeah. We'll tag you as well. Diva D06. We'll tag you as well. Who else likes to follow and would appreciate this? I don't know. I guess we'll leave it at that for now. If you want to fill this out, fantastic. Go ahead and do that. I tag all of you, so <laughs> there you go. I'm sorry I do this all the time, and I, it's like such a cop-out, but it's just, I don't like leaving people out. <laughs> it's just the way I am. And the geese are honking. They're heading south for the winter. It's so pretty. <laughs> yeah. So we're going to finish up here and continue on with our walk, and see how long it takes us to do this entire park or lake trail whatever <laughs> so far it's been over an hour and we're about halfway so we might make it in two hours this time we'll see <laughs> hopefully we have a little bit of energy get my water in yeah. i had my yogurt before coming so my sandwich was so good my breakfast <laughs> so good yeah, I'll probably have like an omelet or something when I get home. Egg and cheese and green peppers and onions and mm -hmm. yum. And this is Bentley. Oh, <laughs> if you can see him. Oh. Bentley. Hey. Say hi, buddy. <laughs> oh, he's not oh, happy. No. He's got his leader on and his <laughs> He's ready to go. Oh my god. Oh, I know, buddy. We're gonna go. <laughs> all right, we'll see you all later. Oh. Bye for now, guys. <laughs>